Okay, we just got sent this little device which is called the Time Kettle T1 Mini Translator. And if this thing works, it's gonna change the way we travel because it's an instant translator. You press one button and it translates between English and whatever other language you wanna use. We're gonna test it now. This is literally the first time we've tried using this. There's a guy we walk past literally every day here in Bangkok for the last month and we've sort of gotten to know him without speaking to him because he doesn't speak English, we don't speak Thai. We've established his name and he's figured out our names, but that's it. So I want to have, to have an actual conversation with him and see if this works. Um, and if it does, it's going to be pretty cool. So, so what do you have? Yeah. Hello guys. Uh -huh. Okay. okay. Um, what is your name? My name is Top. Ah, okay. Okay. Where are you from? I'm in Thailand. From Thailand. <laughs> okay. okay. We are from Australia and Canada. Yeah. We are from Australia and Canada. Same. Lovely to meet yeah. you. Thank you. <laughs> I have this device that can translate English into Thai. Can you understand me? Oh, I have a device that can translate English into Thai. Can you understand me? Oh, I have a you? I'm 56 years old now. Oh. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I have a friend who is a Korean, a friend who is a Korean. I have a friend who is a Korean. Sorry, I didn't get the end there. I have a friend who is a Korean, a friend who is a Korean. สุขุมวิทย์6 5เขาก็มาหาฉันบ่อยเขาให้เงินฉันใช้ด้วย That's very long Yeah yeah I have one two You have one uh, yeah, yeah. You have this Yeah I have no Oh yes it's not เพื่อนฉันฉันเนี่ยฉันผมมาตกอันนี้อันนี้อันนี้ยังไ Yeah yeah it's raining เนี่ยเพื่อนเพื่อนญี่ปุ่นญี่ปุ่นอันนี้เพื่อนญี่ปุ่นเขากลับประเทศญี่ปุ่นไปแล้วนี่อันนี้ลูกชายเขาเนี่ยอ๋อโอ้โหชอบสัตว์เลี้ยงโอเคได้ได้เยอะเยอะเพื่อนฉันทั้งนั้นเลยนี่ก็เพื่อนฉันอันนี้อันนี้คือคนจีนที่ได้แฟนเป็นฝรั่ง This one is a Chinese guy who that can't be right Got a girlfriend as a blowtorch. And then she's been by bar, she's been bun. Is that right? <laughs> she like we're playing cards against humanity oh, yeah. or something. Oh, blowfish. Oh yeah. Well, yeah. Uh, <laughs> blowfish, blow not blowtorch. So like a couple of words, I think, are a little bit off. Yeah. But like you can kind of decipher what. And that can be slang. Then you get a job. Nee. That's you. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's Where's mine. This? Wow. อายุ19ปีวัน9ใช่ไหมวัน9วัน919 oh 19 the photo it's you ใช่มาแล้ว your your mama is still here แม่ของฉันเดี๋ยวนี้ท่านอายุ83ปีท่านยังแข็งแรงท่านอยู่ที่จังหวัดเชียงรายครับ my mother right now for 80 I think it's 83 years old and still healthy wow, wow. 
โอเคแล้วโอเคท่านยังได้วีโอเธอแล้วนี่อ่าสบาย Thank you Thank you Thank you Bye Bye It seems to pretty much translate everything with like a few words that you kind of have to figure out on your own but I want to test it maybe when we're not somewhere that's like so noisy and stuff but I mean we found out his age where he's from his mum Yeah Um And he showed us a video of scattering somebody's ashes in the water. I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah, it jumped around a little bit. Yeah, but it's cool anyway. But yeah, like it's awesome. like before this, all we've been saying is he says mana and we say Lloyd and Mandy, and yeah. then we, <laughs> we shake That's hands. <laughs> yeah, that was cool. Yeah. Okay, so after testing the Time Kettle T1 Mini Translator with our friend Mana or our new friend Mana, uh, it's pretty good. Like for the past month, we've been walking past him every day, and all we've been saying is our own names because we couldn't get past the language barrier. It was pretty cool to actually find a little bit out about him, and it worked. We figured out his age. I think he said 56. About his mother, who lives in Chiang Mai, and he said she's still very healthy. And there was um, a photo he showed us, and from the translator, it got it. I think like 90% correct. Um, and it basically said they were scattering ashes into the water. So I, I'm thinking that might have been like a loved one, like a wife or something like that. I'm not sure. But yeah, like I think the only issue with it was that it was pretty loud. Like we were right in the middle of the street in Bangkok with like traffic and it was raining. Um, so I had it set on the function where it actually brings up the text on the screen because it was too loud to actually hear it. And that worked well, like he could read what we were saying and we could read what he was saying. But because of the background noise, um, I think it didn't get everything 100% correct. Like there was a couple of words that were a bit wrong. But also the thing with the Thai language is it's not a language like English. Um, they actually use tones. So there's like five different tones they use to say something and it can mean a different thing. So we had that working against us as well. I think this device is going to be really good for anyone who's traveling to countries where you might be going off the beaten path a little bit, like not in the touristy areas, and you want to be able to just quickly pull this out and be able to speak the local language with people. It's just got two buttons. So you got this button at the top here, and as soon as you push that, it turns on. So that's ready to go now. And then if I just hold this button, I can speak into it and it'll translate automatically. Hello, my name is Lloyd. And as you can see, the text comes up there as well as it actually says it and you can hear it. I think it's great for emergencies especially. So like you can get away with not speaking a local language when you're traveling, but if you're in an emergency and you really need to like find like a hospital or if you're going through customs, sometimes I know I've been going through customs and they ask a lot of questions. Sometimes you can't understand them or they can't understand you. Also, it's actually really small. Like this is about half the size of an iPhone. When you buy it straight out of the box, it'll actually come with one year worth of data. So you don't need to be on Wi-Fi or anything to use this. It'll work 100% all the time. You don't need a SIM card or anything. You just turn it on and it'll start working straight out of the box. And it has a standby time of seven days. So you can leave it on like it's on right now and you just click the button. Also, one of the other cool features that we tried out um, was it has this feature where you can scan a photo of like a sign or like writing and it'll actually do a scan and then it'll translate it into English in real time. And it only takes like a few seconds and it translates the whole thing. All right, we're gonna use the photo translation now. It's got a little camera here. We're trying to find some vitamins to stock up on, um, but like all this is in Thai. So if this thing works, this is gonna be really good. It takes a photo and scans it. It's doing its thing now. Whoa, how cool is that? And it just replaces the words with English words. That's awesome. That's that, actually that's so pretty, handy. That's pretty cool. Yeah. So if there's ever like signs or whatever, if you're trying to catch a train or something like that, and you can't read the sign, you can't read like a machine or something, you just use this. That's so handy. That's pretty handy. 
So yeah, look, it's pretty good. It's not perfect, but it's as close to perfect as you can get. If the surroundings and the conditions are all correct, there's no like wind or it's not too loud or anything and everybody's speaking clearly, it'll get everything 100%. Other than that, it's probably gonna get about 95% and it's easy enough though to sort of decipher what the missing words are. Like when I was speaking to Mana, um, there was a couple of words that looked a bit off, but I could still figure out what he was saying. Like it was pretty easy to figure out and he definitely knew everything I was saying. So yeah, we're gonna take this everywhere we go actually now because it recognizes 38 different languages, um, which means pretty much everywhere we go, we're gonna be able to use it. And I think it's a really cool thing to just have on you all the time, especially for an emergency situation. It's not too expensive. It's $149 US. And as I said, that gets you one year worth of free data as well. So check it out for yourself if you want to give it a go. Uh, we'll leave the link down below in the description. And thanks for watching another video. If you enjoyed this and you found it helpful, go ahead and click the like button and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one.